Hello everyone, my name is Abdullah Zawan from Indonesia and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to talk about AnyViewer, a remote desktop software for Windows. As you can see here, AnyViewer available for Windows, iOS, and Android. And this is the key feature such as secure and quick remote access, end-to-end -end encryption, and also 100% safe and clean. Here, we can free download the size only 40 megabyte. And this is like why we consider to choose any viewer as a remote desktop. Here, unattended remote access, fast file transfer, and also ultra simple configuration. So we don't require extra configuration for remote access on a different network. And this is what is coming soon, such as remote printing without sending file to our local computer and also take a screenshot of the remote computer. And if you were the default is free, but here we can see the pricing with professional we will get here all the features such as higher speed, one license user, 10 login device, and so on. Here, unlimited channel, and so on. And this is if we choose enterprise. So if you want to try this professional, you can click link in the description below. All right, so without any further ado, let's download this. Just press this free download or you can click link in the description below because i have download so i just need to open it so as you can see here this is my any viewer so here this is the device id and temporary security code so with this code we can access our remote desktop so which is this any viewer so here because i haven't yet logged in and here the upgrade button so i just need to log in first All right, so I have logged in into my AnyViewer account. And as we can see here, right now, my plan is Pro Edition. So here, login device, two of 10 device. And here, AnyViewer can be used on Windows, iOS, and Android. Here, how we connect to this uh, computer or we can control using this start control and we can type the partner id and we can choose remote control or fire transfer and this is the device so this device is this desktop win 11 and this is another device so i want to test this on my iphone all right so this is uh any fever on my iphone so here on the home we will see like device and we see desktop win 11 because you know this any fever app login with the same account so it will detect our device so we can just press this and we will see like one click control, view screen, lock, restart, shutdown, and so on. So let's press this one click control. And we will see like any viewer would like to find and connect to device and just press hello. And this is like gesture gate and finish 
and now I have successfully control my desktop win 11 using my iPhone so here I can control my Windows 11 using my iPhone all right as you can see here all right so it's very easy if we log in our account in many device so we will see like a list device we have logged in all right so we can press stop connection here and just press ok and here iPhone has an uh, remote access here we also see few screen here all right with this we only see the screen without control the device and then stop connection again all right and the another way we can connect using this connect button and we need to input the device id and then press connect and yeah this is the way we connect to uh, my desktop here all right so i think this is very easy so we don't need extra configuration so we can just input device id and what we say here such as temporary security code and if we have an any viewer account we can log into device so we can see all device we have logged in here so we can easily connect to our device we want to access and here the setting we can set security code so it means it will be permanent security code and here recipient controller we can set the image quality such as high quality balance or high speed and we can also hide the desktop wallpaper and this is the security we can auto lock any viewer and then lock any viewer when local computer is locked and the basic here we can change the name change the device name and here start any viewer with windows and so on and this is prevent this device from automatically sleeping so yeah i think this uh, remote desktop software which is any viewer is good for us if we want to work remotely so we don't need to extra configuration to access our remote desktop but the limitation this software available only for windows if your main device is not windows maybe this is not a good option because any if we were not yet available on another device so i hope this any if you were consider to develop another app on mac os maybe on linux all right so yeah i think that's enough my video today if you want to download this 
and if you were so you can click link in the description below thank you so much and see you again on the next video